for the orchestra students at Cedar Hill High School. Last year ended on a sad note. Yeah, I, I definitely cried a little bit. I was a mess. I was bawling and everything. I mean, it was taking everything in me to not just start sobbing because, I mean, that was, that was so much. Back in May, orchestra director Elizabeth Judd told the students last year was her last year. She was retiring to focus on her husband's health, and her students weren't the only ones struggling to say goodbye. Gut-wrenching, absolutely gut-wrenching. And I knew then that maybe, maybe I wasn't done. You know, these kids, they are everything to me. Two months after she retired, she returned. See, I told you I'd come back. Students expecting to see a new teacher were absolutely stunned. Miss Judd, I, 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 was, I was running down the hallway. I thought I was having a prank pulled on me. Once they realized she was here to stay, they started to play. <laughs> Students say Ms. Judd has taught them so much about music, but even more about life. Many of us matured and became the person that we are today because of her. I am ridiculously proud of you. Ms. Judd says, you so right back at you. They teach me every day how to love, Uncon unconditional love. I love them. And they love her. So much so, many of them want to follow in Ms. Judd's footsteps. Being able to build those connections with students and help them grow, I think is something that's really made me want to pursue music and music education. So if you turned out to be like Ms. Judd, you'd consider it a success? Definitely. Music to her ears. Super glad you're back. In Cedar Hill. Love ya. I'm Sean Giggy. Two things here. Number one, Mrs. Winkleman. I still remember my music teacher from elementary mm -hmm. school because that's how impactful she was. Yep. And then number two, we do a lot of stories about these new teachers, which I love, but considering how long some educators have been in their systems, it's incredible. I was just looking at Facebook. Some of my teachers have been in their systems for, in their districts, 33 years, for instance, my theater teacher. And especially when it comes to the arts, who they got some big hurdles to jump over and so um yeah i mean hats off to her well we've everyone told so many position. stories about teachers leaving the classroom as well and for good reason for many of them yeah. so a teacher who decides to come back to the classroom and make an impact on those kids life it's a it's a big story tough it's time huge. for educators right now yeah hey still to come on day